Some kids have not used border cover before, especially for the little ones and the beginners. For us at all, most of us who know how to use watercolor palette like this. We use the brush, dip it in the water, and mix it with, uh, on the palette and wait for the color to come out and then we can use it. But for some kids, it's not as easy as you think. You'll be surprised. Many come to me and go, Miss Anna, it's too hard. It all dried up, I can't use it. Before I have time to explain everything to them. Then I go, you have to use some water. Then they dip some water with the brush and use all the string and tick, 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 like this little note. And then still go to me, it's too hard. I can't use the color. So with kids, you have to think of fun and easy way for them to use the media. Well, hi, my name is Miss Anna. Welcome to Moving Out Room. So today, I'm going to show you my way of teaching the kids how to use watercolor. There are lots of different brands of watercolor around. Choose the palette type, not the tube type. The tube type is too small. If you give them to the kids, they will help you to finish them in five minutes. I've got three palettes here. Some watercolor is harder than the other. Some with colors more intense than the other. You will only know the characteristics until you have tried them out. The softer ones are easier for kids to use because they don't have to mix it with water for so long. Some kids may not have the patience to wait for that long for the colors to melt. So that's why the softer ones are better for kids. Like I said before, some kids may not have used watercolor before, so you may need to explain to them how to use it. But how? was an easy way to get the kids to remember. Some may not know how to judge, like how long should they do the mixing before they can paint. For us, we know when the color is rich enough to apply on the painting or when it's too pale or watery. Don't laugh about this if you have not had much experience with kids painting. It may sound too simple and obvious to you. You may go, I'm sure that we know how to use it. That's great if they do. However, if using the watercolor palette doesn't come so easy to your kid at first, so this is where you can help. You test out with the water yourself. See about how many circles you have to make until the color is ready to use. Some palette may need eight times, some may need 10 or more. You test it out first, then tell your kid, get some water on your brush, go around in circle eight times. Count with them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you can use it, or whatever fun system you can think of, or even a little tune to make it fun with them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Just like this. Welcome to put in comments below to share your experience with painting with kids or simply share your kids' artwork with us. But well, thank you for watching this. Please subscribe and hit the notification button and please like our Facebook page. I'll share with you more tips about kids' drawing and painting skills.